Hey guys, this is a video for those of you who are wondering if your iPad's gonna be able to update to latest iPad OS 26. So basically, if you don't see it on this list, it's not gonna be able to. So for example, if you have an iPad mini fourth generation, it's not gonna be able to. You need an iPad mini fifth generation or later. Then you guys have an iPad mini A17 Pro, that you guys can iPad 8 generation or later, yes. So let's say you guys have an iPad 7, 6, 5, you won't be able to. As for an iPad Air, third generation or later can. So if you guys have an iPad Air 2 or the first generation, it won't be able to. iPad Air M2 can, iPad Air M3 can, iPad Pro, first generation, 11 inch can. Okay, so anything above that can. An iPad Pro, 12.9 inch, third generation or later can. So if you guys have the first generation, which is one of my favorites, by the way, uh, second generation won't be able to either. So it has to be the third generation or later of an iPad Pro 12.9 inch. Then you guys have an iPad Pro M4. Obviously, that's newer. So it will be able to update to the latest iOS 26. Now, are there ways to update your iPad to the latest iOS? Well, not really. It can only be if it's compatible. So it's hardware has to be compatible with the software. In this case, this is the software. So yes, you're gonna be looking around, looking at a bunch of scam websites where they charge you, some are free, some just want to, I don't know. I don't, I don't even know what they want to do to your iPads, but it's not a good thing. And there's a bunch of scams out there. Don't fall for those. Do not pay anything, by the way, to get your older iPad to be updated to the latest iPadOS. 26 because it's just not gonna happen and yes if you're looking at this video and you're thinking well there's jailbreak yeah you can jailbreak your ipad i've done it a thousand times but that still won't be able to make it update to the latest ipad os 26 so again if your ipad is not on this list it's not going to be able to okay so you're only going to be able to go up to a certain point and that's it you're not really missing out on much and only it really new apps, apps that came out this year alone or the next one might require a certain iPadOS like the latest one. That's true. But hey, there's nothing else we can do but buy a newer iPad. And yes, part of the reason Apple does this is so you buy a newer iPad. But let's face it, the hardware from the iPad won't be able to handle the latest update as well. So that's part of the reason too. Anyways, as far as this video goes, we're all done. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Thank you.